So with fermentation, it's a chemical reaction. When you introduce that yeast of ours to it, the yeast starts basically eating up the sugar. It's breaking them down. So when it breaks the sugar apart, it makes alcohol for one, and it makes CO2 gas, which creates the bubble. And then also from about hour 10 to hour 45 or so, it makes its own heat. It produces its own heat. So it can look hot. They actually can feel warm off the top, but it's never going to be hot to the touch. Because if the yeast gets above about 86 Fahrenheit, it kills the yeast and you ruin fermentation. So you've got to keep it cool from the inside the whole process. And we're able to do that all year long. There you go.